girl Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome tap that subscribe button y'all make sure you don't miss any of my upcoming videos and if you've been rocking with me for a minute what's up what's good and welcome back so today I have a unit by the Janet collection and it's one of their new units from the natural me light collection this Unit here is Tiana. Now I know the Tiana that I'm wearing looks a bit different from the stock card, but we are going to talk about it. So this unit does come with your typical cap construction, your two combs in the front, comb in the back, adjustable straps. It is a lace front unit, so there is lace to cut out the pack. This has a 100% hand tied part that I would say goes back like a good five inches and it has Swiss lace. Of course, the main highlight of this unit is the blowout texture, the natural texture. This is definitely mimicking African-American 4B, 4C hair. So let me just give you a quick 360 and I'll dive right into my thoughts. All right, y'all, let's get into my thoughts on Tiana. The reason why Tiana looks different is because when I first took her out the pack and I put her on, I was shifting her to the side and I shifted her back to the middle. I wasn't feeling the style at all, which surprised me because I really liked the way she looked on Cassie That Girl and I really liked the way she looked on the Hearts and Cake 90. I, I was like, I've been holding on to her for a while and I was feeling really excited to review her again. But the curls were just not working for me. So I was like, bump it. I'm just going to straighten it out. I used my blow dryer at first, but then it wasn't straightening it out enough. So I had to use a flat iron off camera. Even though this texture is heat safe, it doesn't take high heat well because some parts definitely started burning. <laughs> So I suggest starting on a very low heat, like maybe under 300 and seeing how the unit does. But either way, there was shedding from the hair burning off. That was that. But it still did not lose the natural yaki texture. It still feels like blown out straight texture. It feels really nice. I like it better just straightened out. I, I wasn't feeling those curls. The ends here, you know, I started trimming them. They're a little choppy. I would have to work on that a little bit, but overall it's fine. So as far as pros, definitely the texture, very natural, very yucky texture. And I love that this is a soft yucky texture. I talked about Janet Collection wigs before when they first started coming out with their Kingston Curls line. Love me some Jode, love me some Jenna, but the texture was very, very rough. So this natural me light collection i'm so happy that this texture is way softer and honestly janet collection i would love if 
y'all redid Jode and just put it as a part of the Natural Me Light collection. Like that would be so dope because I love the style of that unit. I just don't like the fibers. So this feels amazing to me. Love, love, love it. Another pro is the cap size. For my friends who have larger heads, this unit will definitely fit your head. I have a medium sized head. I'm about 22 inches and some change. And I definitely did have to use the straps to adjust, adjust it tighter, but it's no problem. It fit very nicely. I also like that the hairline is looking pretty seamless here. I am wearing this glueless, y'all. Okay, I'm wearing a glueless. And you can see it kind of just blends right in once I put my makeup on the hairline. Another great thing about this unit is that it's very affordable. It retails for about $29, $30. So I think that's a great price, especially for this, you know, kinky straight texture. I mean, it's mimicking human hair very, very well. So kudos to the price. As far as the cons, main con was the way it came styled at the pack. I thought I would like it. I didn't, but you know what? That happens sometimes. Sometimes you receive a wig and it doesn't look how you expect it to look on you. I don't want you guys to feel discouraged if that happens to you. You can easily just switch it up. Synthetic wigs these days are heat safe. So take a flat iron, take a blow dryer like I did. Some of y'all know that I love my Revlon blow dryer brush. That is Bay. If you're interested in it, it'll be linked in the description box down below. It's an Amazon affiliate link. So if you buy it or buy anything through that link, it helps me out. I think once I put my blow dryer to this baby, it was good to go. I think she looks really good. It almost reminds me of Sensational Boss Babe, which I also blow dry it a bit. It's just Boss Babe is a little bit shorter. I review a lot of textured wigs, y'all. So if you are interested in those other textured wigs that mimic 4B, 4C, blown out hair, kinky curly, kinky straight. If you like those type of wigs, please check out my playlist. I have a slew of them that I have reviewed. A lot of them that I love. Definitely check that playlist out. But yeah, overall, I'm feeling Tiana like this. Tell me, what do you think? Do you like the way I remixed her? Because I think she's really cute like this. I really do. If I wanted to, I could have added some extra layers, but I just didn't feel like doing too much. She looks really nice. Okay, Tiana girl. <laughs> I prefer feathered ends though. I'm, I'm not always a big fan of, you know, the choppy ends. So I would probably thin out the bottom to make it more feathered. But this is definitely mimicking like very natural blown out 4B, 4C hair. And I'm here for it. So yes, y'all, tell me what you think about Tiana and my remix of her in the comments down below. Would you cop this wig for summer? I think it's great for summer. It's short, it's lightweight, the density is great. I think this is definitely a summer unit. If you are interested in buying this unit, definitely check out Sans Beauty. They have it in stock in this color. And just because I didn't like the style doesn't mean you won't like the style. It's all a matter of preference. If you are new here, tap that subscribe button, join the family, introduce yourself, stay a while, let's get to know each other. Shout out to Sans Beauty for sponsoring this video. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.